Hello, this is George Sender, the real, official, authentic, original, one and only, the guy from Pittsburgh. Except no cheesy YouTube commentators, imposters, or trolls. And I just thought I'd show you, this is the pizza place, front room, and what they have to do here in Martinez, because we're at, I think, sea level. There's a creek back there. And the businesses all here have to um, put out sandbags to the doorways. So there's one over there, a bunch here. And the, the street has been known last year in January at this time. It flooded. This whole street was flooded. Here's the new rays. And so. This is what they have to do out here. I'm walking home, so I thought I'd do a video of, here's a nail spa. I think there must be about nine million nail spas. Tax guy, barbershop. We had hail coming down a few minutes ago through these flowering apple trees. I don't think they're apple trees, but there's no apples in an apple blossom or something. This guy was a plumbing place. <laughs> you can see the tile there. And he he went under. This guy makes belts and stuff, custom made belts, about $60 per belt. There's the public defender's office, it used to be a theater. There's the theater. Wells Fargo Bank, DA's office, post office, court. Sky. Copper skillet courtyard restaurant. Developmentally, disa developmentally disabled place. The former gas station, at one time the oldest gas station in Martinez. We've eaten this restaurant, it's so good, so we got sick. This used to be a Plymouth Chrysler dealership. This guy does flooring and he seems to be doing okay. Nothing in here on this side. But this would have been cool. I had never had the money to buy it and restore it for the car. Because it used to be a very old Plymouth dealer. Here's the soup kitchen. That building has been vacant. A house burned on that corner. They tore it down. That's now an air conditioning place. Used to be a, a Union 76 station. Here is the senior center. And I'm going to head home. Uh, Orangey, unfortunately, does not come out when it's raining, so usually. So I will go feed Mama Cat and Kitten and go upstairs. So, uh, this guy has been perpetually for rent. Let's see, hopefully, we we'll drop it in the creek. Here's our raging Martinez Ohamba Creek. Oh, you won't go. There we go. This thing really gets full of water. This is the apartment where the cat used to live. There's another one. Yeah, remodeling this. They've been remodeling this building over at the white. And I mean to do this, but it's been raining all the time. This building, I took all the windows and boarded them up. This was the one I didn't abandon on. Here's the Masonic Temple. And this one, they are remodeling the building at last. 
They've torn everything out of here, and you can see the big pile of debris down there. But they took out walls, and mirrors, and doors, and God knows what, and they put security where they put, closed the security doors because the homeless were sleeping in here and starting fires. So this is all boarded up now. They even tore out the mailbox. So, but it's all fenced off back there. And you can see uh, the window's boarded up. And uh, it's hard to walk without my cane. Someone stole my cane. There's the moon. And here's home. And this is the apartment house across the street. Talky, not talky, uh, Fluffy and uh, little girl and Leslie are all inside. And let's see if I, I don't know if I have enough to feed. Uh, Mama Cat and Kitten with me or not. But it was pouring rain 10 minutes ago. So, uh, you know, you me? I don't know if my neighbor wants to be on YouTube or not, so I'm not going to film her. There's upstairs. You can see the hill on our re recycling bin. Here's here's the bits of hail. So still on there. Yeah. Hailed up here too. There's the little girl. I thought she was in. Little girl. I thought little girl was in. Little girl. Little girl. Here's the little girl. Little girl. Here's my little girl, my sweet girl. I think I just saw Mama Cat. Mama Cat. Here's Mama Cat. Oh, hello, Mama Cat. Oh. oh. All right. Let me see what I got here. For the kitties. And one. I have two. I have three. Yay! I can feed the kitties. Come on, Mama. Fluffy, little girl. Come on. Mama kid. Sweet Mama kid. Kitten. Sweet mama cat. Uh, oh, the Korean lady left food for them. Hello, sweet mama cat. Hello, my mama cat. Hello. Uh, uh, there's kitten. All right. There's one. Oh, I can't do this one-handed, really easily. There's two. Hello, kitten. Hello, kitten. Hello, kitten. Yeah, loving the kitten in the mouth. Again. Here, kitten. There's kittens. Get, 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 get. Kitten gets scared all the time. I love her dearly. She does get frightened. Hello, little girl. So there's a little girl. All right. That's it for now. See you later, Mama Cat. Bye, kitten. Little girl, I'll get you to come in later. All right, this is George Senda, the guy from Pittsburgh, cat feeding and walking. Have a great night. Stay wet, warm, dry, or safe as the case may be. And hopefully you're dry and warm.
kitties have their little house under the stairs now, so at least they won't don't get wet. All right, I'm going upstairs. Bye bye for now. This is George Sedler, the guy from Pittsburgh. The ghost is still working. <laughs> the other two are not working. The ghost is still working. The haunted outdoor light. This is George Sedler again. Lisa was very distressed to hear that you almost slipped in the ice. Please be careful because your cat's. Uh, Sheba and, and Muffy need you, and they are two of the cutest cats, if not the cutest cats on the YouTube. So, uh, be careful out there in the snow and ice back east. This is George Sender, the guy from Pittsburgh. Bye-bye for now.